Kristen. And I'm Kayla. And we are Kay. And Kay. Create. Create. Thank you for joining us for another video. Hopefully you're coming off of the other premieres from this evening's Monday night a premiere train. Uh, started with acrylic painting with Julie E. Mm -hmm. And then pouring together with Lance, Lance Travis. Travis. And, and Angie Mason Fluid Art. Art. And then we are the Caboose. Yes. So um, welcome to our channel. Uh, Kayla picked out the colors for tonight's pour. Yes. Today is actually Mother's Day. And we're going to be painting together on Mother's Day. Yep. Yeah. So Kayla, We're just recording this on Sunday. Yes, so we're just doing it on <laughs> Sunday. So um, we hope you enjoy. Kayla picked out some beautiful colors. And we'll... Um, Come down on the canvas in just a second. Mm -hmm. Hello, everyone. Hello. Hello. Yes, yes, yes. And we have some beautiful colors here for you. Okay, yes. you ready to introduce them? Yes. Okay, go ahead. So first we have Pebio Studio Acrylics Transparent Rose as O. Yeah. And this is a very pretty pink color. Mm -hmm. And it is fairly thick. Um, I mixed all of the paints tonight using Mix Pour. You can get your own Mix Pour by um, contacting Krista, right? Um, yeah. At Krista8974 at gmail.com. Yes. So next we have Folk Art Metallic Fire Opal. Yes. So this is a very pretty color. Uh, sometimes mixed with the golden quinacridone. Can I? Yes. <laughs> to make nickel opal. To make nickel opal, yes. <laughs> okay. Next we have golden fluid acrylics. I forgot how to say it again. Napfall. Napfall red meat. Napfall red medium. This is a beautiful it. red color. It's a bright, very bright. Blue, like true red. Very it's, pretty. It's very bright. Yes. Next we have Decor Extreme Sheen 24 karat gold. Yes. But it's Extreme Sheen this time. Yeah. Oh, our camera got tilted. Oh no. It's okay. All right. So I left this a little thick so that hopefully it will, it will not just end up a uh, shimmer covering the whole canvas. Yeah. Next we have Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics Champagne Gold. Yep, same with this. I left it a little bit thick. Okay, Champagne Gold. Next we have Windsor & Newton Galleria Acrylic Vermilion Hue. Yes, and this is a very bright orange. Very bright. It's, and it's very, it leans to red. It's very dark. Yes. Next we have Golden Acrylics, Light Ultramarine Blue, mixed with Decoart Holographic Illusions Crystal Ball. Yep. This is what the crystal ball is supposed to shine like. Well, we'll see when it dries, but yeah, I don't know. We'll doesn't, it doesn't look like anything Happened. in the cup. <laughs> and then we just also have some Titanium White from Liquitex yeah. and a White Flow Extender. Okay, I'm going to water down a couple of these paints because they're still very thick. No. Do you want to introduce your canvas in the meantime? Oh, yes. So today I am pouring on a 14 by 14 Artisoft canvas. Mm -hmm. Level one. 14 right? by 14 inch yes. canvas. Right. Level, Level one. one. Mm -hmm. And what kind yes. of pour are you going to do today? Today I'm going to do a wandering ring pour. Gonna do a attempt again okay <laughs> because the last time <laughs> all right so you're gonna do a wandering ring pour on a square canvas yeah so are you going to do it corner to corner yeah corner to corner just in one direction in and one then you're direction. gonna tilt it and then tilt it boop, boop. okay yes all right so let's Let's fix this camera a little bit. Hold on a second. Okay, so Kayla's going to do two wandering ring pours. Mm -hmm. And for this 14 by 14 inch canvas, we need seven ounces of paint. So I'm gonna do two cups of about four ounces each. These are five ounce little cups. So I'll fill them most of the way up. 
Okay. All right. So, are you ready? Mm -hmm. Okay. What, what I'm color? trying not to talk because my hiccups. She's got the hiccups. Yeah. So, <laughs> excuse her if you hear hiccups. Yeah. Okay. So, what color would you like to start with? Red. Mm -hmm. Oh, boy. Red. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, don't put the white next to the red, you know, right? Do not. Yeah. Yeah. Because Do we not. don't want pink, right? Mm hmm. All right, so a little bit of red. I'm not going to put too much. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hmm. The fire opal? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's pretty. So here's Kayla's two cups. Mm -hmm. Now, do you want to pour into a? Maybe I'll put a line down for you. Yeah. Of a gold, line down. one gold and one champagne or something. Uh, sure. Yeah. You're gonna yeah. do two one. Okay. So okay. we're back because the the phone stopped recording and it's probably because I was getting text messages. Yeah. <laughs> so guess what got turned off. The video. No, text message notifications got turned off because oh, yeah. I don't want that happening. Uh, okay, so my are so, so sorry. my stupid phone turned off twice, and we I missed did. Kayla's um ring pour. Yeah. So I'm very mad about that. I'm keeping and an that, eye on and it, and she's keeping an eye on it. So um, I'm gonna just put the flow extender down. Yeah. Keep an eye on the phone. I am. Keep an eye and it kind of met in the middle, yeah. so that's good. And so please keep an eye on that. All we times. gave it a. You want me to torch it? Because there's some oh, yeah, there's some there's cells popping up. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We've given it time to kind of settle because I've been messing with my phone. Yeah. So it's had time to. Uh, they've had time to meet in the middle. Okay. All right. You're good to go. Tilt away, my dear. Okay. Make sure. Moving oh, Kayla, that's beautiful. Ooh. Wow. Ooh. 
me to torch it one more time? Yay! All right, let's move it a little bit. So but yeah, yeah, I meant yes. Yeah. So. And now we'll mix together on my gloves. All and right, so there's Kayla's fi fine, uh, final. There's Kayla's finished product. This came out really cool. Let me just torch any remaining bubbles. And I made pink on my hands. You made pink, yeah. And you made a little bit of purple on the canvas, but you can definitely yeah, see still it. see the blue. Imprint. Yeah, you can still see the blue. The red looks nice. Um, it came out really pretty, Kayla. Thank you. Very excellent job, my love. All right, we'll take you in for the close-up at the end, and I'll touch up her edges. Oh, I am going to be doing a ring pour, regular ring pour that I might wreck. We'll see how it comes out. So um, today I am using a 16-inch Blick Premier Canvas. Um, it takes about nine ounces of paint. So I have a cup here that holds 10 ounces, so I'm probably going to fill it most of the way up. And I think I want my center to be gold and red. So I'm going to put a little That's a bit. Good idea. Thank you. I'm going to put a little bit of gold and a little bit of red because I don't want a whole lot. Okay. And that's going to be my center. I think I'm going to add some fire opal. And then some white. my cup. <laughs> mm -hmm. You having fun? Yeah. All right, just gonna move these paints out of the way. There's my canvas. Oh, that's a big canvas. Yeah, it is. All right, so you can't really see. I know. Much. I'm gonna have to move this camera. Hold. No, I got it. Okay. Okay. So back. I adjusted the camera a little bit so we could get the whole canvas in there. Yes. Yes. Okay, so I'm gonna take what little is left, oops, of this gold. The pouring too. Not much left at all. But that's okay. And I'm going to do a ring pour. Nice. A normal ring pour. A normal ring pour. Not like me when I did a wand ring. Right. It's just a normal. Okay. Are we ready? Yes. I'm ready. Okay, that looks amazing. Thank you. I got a little bit of a tail. Yeah. But that's, that's okay because I think I'm going to wreck it. What do you think? You think I should wreck it or no? No. No? Mm -mm. No wrecking? Well, maybe you could get, just get the stick, like, move it in. Do the center a little bit? Yeah. All right, so let's fix up this middle. 
got out. Alright, I don't like that. <laughs> yeah, now. <laughs> so let's see if I can. You know what? I'm going to do a Mina trick. So I'm going to have a piece of cardboard to catch. And let's see if we can. A Mina trick. And do this again. Oh, no, I made it worse. Now I got to wreck it. Yeah, now you got to wreck it. Oh, no. All right, let me let me put my flow extender down and wreck this bad boy. Let's wreck this thing. So let's wreck right through that. Okay. And I'm going to come in one more time and get through that middle. Or maybe I'll just wreck from the middle out. Oh, yeah, that's cool. That looks like a heart now in the middle. I made a heart. Can you see it? Yeah. Heart good. shape? Yeah, good. All right. So now I'll just add another, like, couple of loop de loops. That's it. All right. Here we go. Let's open this bad boy up a little bit.
That's the way I'm going to leave it. I'll take you in for a close-up and clean up my edges. Okay, so here's Kayla's finished piece. She kept some very nice lines. I'm surprised she kept it pretty much straight up and down. They didn't get wonky or anything from her tilting. So she did a great job. batteries dying so I better make it quick <laughs> all right oh yeah see look she got a little bit of purple going on there but it looks really pretty okay so there's Kayla's finished piece okay and here's mine my wrecked ring and this is where I tried <laughs> kind of made that heart it used to be in the center, now it's off center. I'm very happy with the results. I like that blue part here, it looks pretty. I lost a lot of my white, that's okay. All right, so there's my finished piece. Thank you again for joining us. Uh, give us a thumbs up. Please leave a comment if you haven't already. Uh, please like and subscribe. And until the next video, we'll see you then. Okay, thank you. Good night.